the only way to live your life is to keep on growing. Almost 99 out of 100 people that I meet are not happy where they live. By willpower, by willing it, you can overcome your own fate. Change the course of your destiny. You know, most people, they don't become successful because at some point of time, they don't want to. And they, that is the only way you don't succeed. As long as you want to, nothing can stop you. You will reach the peak. I've always wanted to make uh, to do great things. I just didn't believe that I would achieve it. And I said, if a single mom and an Arab, just like me, can do this uh, business and succeed so well and change their lives, then I can also do that. And I felt that there is an equal opportunity for every kind of person, wherever the background is, you know, regardless of uh, race, creed, religion, color, you know, gender, anything, um, that you can also do it. So if these people can do it with just two arms, two legs, you know, two eyes, two ears, then I can also do it. He should go all out and persevere. Things may not go the way he wants, but the secret is to keep on going. Never ever give up. If people could quit their jobs and then join this business, it means there is something good in it. It doesn't matter your level of education. What matters is we are working because we want to earn a living, live a comfortable life, and also take care of people around us, support our communities. Have grit, keep working on it, do not give up. You know, listen to your appliance and be, be seeking, and keep working. I have one kid who is three years old now. The feeling that his future is secure, and I have to do more and more for his future to be even more secure in the business. My defining moment, each and every day I have an opportunity to sit down and to speak from the heart. If you can sit one-on-one -on -one or in front of a thousand people and you can speak from your heart with conviction, people recognize the truth nowadays because there's actually not a lot of it going around. I believed in it. My heart told me to believe in it and I believed in it. So believe in in, in what your heart tells you. Okay. And avoid listening to dream stealers. Just ignore them and move to the next positive person. Hey, I'm a dreamer. I just dream naturally. The moment I think something is done, then I come up with something bigger than what I just did. And I never thought I could be so much in the last 10 years. I've never imagined that I could come this far. So I think what really it happened in the last few years being with you, Ned, it helped me to truly discover how far I can go and how every single one, even for me who never knew how to dream, I can actually be a big dreamer. I believe in this business strongly. If I have to redo it, I will do it again and again and again because I strongly believe that it's the best business, is the future, is the business of the 21st century. Not a quitter, I'm a Q netter. Every single day I'm learning something new. From limited thinking to limitless thinking. It's all about the heart. I know. Yeah. <laughs> <All right. laughs>
and the more you seek, the more you get to know, and the more they get to know. This is an opportunity. It's knocking on your door. You slam it, shut, without even looking at it. I don't think you're being smart by doing that. You meet a lot of human beings. You make friends. It's, it's been a beautiful journey for us. You know, um, impossible becomes possible when you start doing it, in a sense. If we just could do it now, then the world would change. I said it in Bangui, but I'm not sure. 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 I am living proof. I am a 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 living proof. I am